Hey guys, I'm here. Welcome back to our SPI Ultrasound Physics Registry Review. Feel free to pause the video after I ask the question to give enough time to answer it before I answer it. Let's dive into this thing. How do you make image A look like image B? A, increase color box size. B, increase PRF. C, decrease wall filter. Or D, increase color gain. So how do you make this image here look like this image here? The answer is B, increase PRF to eliminate this aliasing artifact. What does compounding do? A, improves temporal resolution. B, increases penetration. C, reduces shadowing artifacts. Or D, decreases signal to noise ratio. The answer is C, reduces shadowing artifacts and it actually increases signal to noise ratio. Which tissue will produce the shortest wavelength when using a 10 megahertz transducer? A bone, B blood, C soft tissue, or D fat? The answer is D, fat. How do you make image A look like image B. A, increase color box size. B, increase PRF. C, decrease wall filter. Or D, increase color gain. The answer is B, increase PRF to eliminate the spectral Doppler aliasing. What does it mean when a patient tests negative and truly is negative? A, specificity, B, sensitivity, C, positive predictive value, or D, negative predictive value? The answer is D, negative predictive value. What type of artifacts are these arrows pointing to? A. Comatel, B. Acoustic Enhancement, C. Reverberation, or D. Speed Error. The answer is Comatel. What does this image represent? A. Color Doppler, B. Power Doppler, C. Elastography, or D. Duplex Imaging. The answer is C, elastography. Which will have the worst Doppler angle? A, obtuse, B, acute, C, parallel, or D, perpendicular? The answer is D, perpendicular. How do you make image A look like image B? A, increased color box size. B, increase PRF, C, increase wall filter, or D, increase color gain. The answer is increase color gain to help fill in the color flow in the pulmonary veins. How do you make image A look like image B? A, increase color box size, B, increase PRF, C, decrease wall filter, or D, decrease color gain. The answer is B, increase PRF to eliminate this aliasing Doppler artifact. How do you make image A look like image B? A, move the anatomy to the middle of the screen. B, increase PRF. C, decrease wall filter or D, decrease color gain. The answer is B, increase PRF to eliminate this aliasing artifact. How do you make image A look like image B? A, increase frequency, B, increase PRF, C, decrease wall filter, or D, decrease color gain.
The answer is B, increase PRF to eliminate this aliasing artifact. How do you decrease the patient's exposure during an examination? A, decrease operating frequency. B, decrease upper power. C, decrease compensation. Or D, decrease threshold. The answer is B, decrease upper power. What's the best way to increase your image brightness? A, increase upper power. B, increase gain. C, increase time gain compensation. Or D, increase threshold. The answer is B, increase gain. Which will produce the lowest Doppler shift? A, 90 degrees. B, 45 degrees. C, 60 degrees. Or D, zero degrees. The answer is A, 90 degrees. Click on the shadowing caused by disease. The answer is going to be right here, actually, because this right here is a tumor and this is just a rib. So to answer this question, click on the shadowing caused by disease. This would be the correct answer. How do you avoid injury in this image? A, move the patient closer to the sonographer. B, raise the bed to hip level of the sonographer. C, adduct arm to less than 30 degrees or D, move monitor to eye level of the sonographer? The answer is C, adduct arm to less than 30 degrees because you can see the arm here is extended. Which is related to tissue heating of the patient? A, mechanical index, B, alpha power, C, thermal index, or D, attenuation? The answer is C, thermal index. How do you fix this image? A, move the anatomy to middle of the screen. B, decrease PRF. C, change angle of box. Or D, increase wall filter. The answer is D. Increased wall filter. This image shows grossing artifacts, which is kind of like a bleeding in the tissue. Which is associated with pulse wave Doppler? A. Range ambiguity. B. Aliasing. C. Uniform intensity. Or D. Freedom from range resolution. The answer is B. Aliasing. Which is related to dynamic range? A, compression, B, amplification, C, compensation, or D, receiver gain? The answer is A, compression. If your intensity is quadrupled and your amplitude is doubled, what does this mean for your beam? A, doubled, B, halved, C quadrupled or D quartered? The answer is B halved. Which will degrade temporal resolution? A decreasing depth. B, increase propagation speed, C, increase line density, or D, increase pixel size. The answer is C, increase line density. What does it mean when a patient is positive for disease? A, specificity, B, sensitivity, C, positive predictive value, or D, negative predictive value. The answer is B, sensitivity. Click on the dirty shadowing. 
The answer is going to be right in this region here. Dirty shadowing consists of shadow plus brighter echoes. How do you eliminate reverberation artifacts? A. Appetization. B. Use a 1.5D array transducer. C. Increase axial resolution. Or D. Increase lateral resolution. The answer is C. Increase axial resolution. How do you fix this image? A. Angle. B. PRF. C. Wall filter. Or D. Map. The answer is A, angle. This is another color doppler mirror artifact and changing the angle will help reduce this artifact. What's the best way to decrease patient exposure? A, decrease gain. B, decrease suppression. C, decrease time gain compensation. Or D, decrease upper power. The answer is D. Decrease upper power. Click on the contrast. This is an ultrasound phantom, and these little circles here will help optimize or evaluate contrast resolution. So any one of these will be good. Click on the clean shadowing. The answer is going to be right in this region here. And clean shadowing will consist of just dark shadow and won't consist of any bright echoes. What does a duplex examination mean? A. Real-time 2D color Doppler combined with spectral Doppler display. B. Real-time 2D imaging combined with spectral Doppler display. C. Real-time 2D imaging combined with spectral and color Doppler display. Or D. Real-time 2D and 3D imaging combined with spectral Doppler display. The answer is B. Real-time 2D imaging combined with spectral Doppler display. How do you fix this image? A. Move the anatomy to the middle of the screen. B. Increase PRF. C. Change angle of box. Or D. Decrease wall filter. The answer is B. Increase PRF to eliminate this aliasing artifact. Which evaluates abnormal thick, dense tissue by palpation? A. Elastography, B. Demodulation, C. Standout device, or D. Rectification. The answer is A. Elastography. If any of you have any questions about your upcoming SPI boards, feel free to reach out to me at ultrasoundboardview at gmail.com or you can personally text or call at 435-922-1635. If you're looking for extra study material, go to Google, type in ultrasound, board, review, click at the top here, click enter the pass zone, scroll down until you see SPI ultrasound physics mock exams, which is right here, click that, scroll down, and then click subscribe. If you're looking for more of a one-on-one -on -one SPI tutoring, go back to that first page, scroll down, and then click SPI Physics Tutoring. Scroll down, and then click Subscribe. I'm Jim with UltrasoundBoardView.com. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.